Over time, the public services card will be required for most government services in Ireland. People can register for one at over 100 locations, including Intrio offices. The government are planning a €200,000 advertising campaign for the public services card. The card was introduced in 2011 for people claiming social welfare payments. However, the government now wants it to be used for more public services, such as applying for theory tests and passports. We asked DCU students how they feel about the card and the upcoming campaign. Kind of like a roundabout way of introducing a national identity card without calling it one, because they're like, oh, uh, it's not a national identity card, but it's compulsory if you want to get anything, like a passport or anything. It's a bit annoying, kind of, because you already have, like I have my age card and stuff like that, so to have to get another card as well as that just to apply for like your theory and stuff, I don't know, it's a bit silly like. Uh, I know. I I think a lot of people don't agree with it. It's um, was it the Minister for Social Protection Regina Doherty said that was it, it's mandatory but not compulsory. Like and I know I, I, I like you were saying that two hundred thousand spent on this advertising scheme to, to to make it popular and on a thing that people already are not welcoming. It, it seems a bit ridiculous. So it's a complete waste of money. Uh, it could be spent an awful lot better. It's just causing more inconvenience for people trying to apply for these things. It's already a bit of a nuisance having to apply for them in the first place. Applicants must register online at mygovid.ie and then attend a face-to-face -face registration. Applicants must bring documents such as their passport, proof of address and birth certificate.